I know we often talk about it, we're not involved in selling it in Terrachem, but the liquid fertiliser, when we were here last, I think it got to 18 degrees that day. And there's been a lot of days since it was scarcely 9 or 10 and very, very breezy. Um, the dribble bars you're using for the liquid nitrogen and the accuracy of the placement, already this year I've seen evidence of some striping in fields with maybe sometimes it's the machine, but it could be the conditions. Everything's still, still going according to plan with liquid fertilizer. Still happy with your decisions? Yeah, it, it does mean I spend a little bit more time on the sprayer, but you know it's probably my favorite job on the farm, so I, I happily accept that. But I um, have to say, yeah, I mean, that's probably the negative of it, but the reality is, is it's working for me and I'm very happy with it. Okay. You know, very happy and I mean there was days where it was very windy that I wouldn't have been able to go with my fertilizer spreader given the weights but I was able to go out with the liquid so I mean that was a clear advantage in that we had an extra day's work done when before we wouldn't have been able to do that but but I can see it in the crops and I'm sold on it to be honest so and even though you've invested in specific dribble bars for applying the fertilizer for the sprayer and a, a very good storage tank I suppose overall that bit of outlay is more than compensated for by the accuracy and the efficiency of the product. Mm. And it's very clean to work with. And okay. It's, yeah, I'm a total convert, yeah. Okay.